What is going on guys, killer 3 here. I'm going to show you guys how to live stream on OBS. So how do you live stream on OBS? I'm using uh, Streamlabs because most of the videos that I have checked over the past month is just unbelievable. All I see is just OBS. OBS, OBS, OBS Studio, OBS Studio. It's, it's ridiculous. So um, I'm going to show you guys how to uh, live stream on Streamlabs. Let's get into it. And uh, if it helps you guys, make sure you guys hit that like button. If you guys have any like concerns or if you guys have any problems, make sure you guys comment down below and I will see and I will check it out what's going on with it. But right now I'm going to show you guys how to live stream on Streamlabs. So uh, I'm using um, OBS Studio to record. So that's high quality for me, but I use Streamlabs to live stream. So it, it's much, I don't know why, but I like uh, Streamlabs better than OBS. I don't know why, but I like OBS. For the past couple of years, I had this shitty ass laptop that my brother has uh, I used to have a laptop that is like 2.50 or 60 gigahertz and uh to be honest like it's it's not too bad I just I used to stream a lot on OBS on a well I used to uh, use OBS on my old laptop and uh I had some problems trying to get like my bit rate working and my uh like a like trying to like figure out the settings of my um laptop and it's it's just really bad right now i'm using it's a medium uh performance so it's like a uh it's not like a high performance uh pc it's like a medium performance if you guys have a uh like a medium performance like i have a 1650 graphics card gtx it's not too bad um i'm, I'm thinking of buying it soon once i get a job and uh but anyways enough talking um so i think this will be good for high-end pcs too so so um if you guys uh go to video and go to uh base uh, res uh resolution set this to 1920 by 1080p output revolu resolution same thing 1920 by 1080 a downscale filter put on lenzos that's it and uh obviously make it as 60 fps and uh if you guys have problems like if you gain like a cp cpu error like cpu usage go to a go to advanced uh process priority set this as above normal go to output yeah go to output uh, I have the uh, allergies. Uh, you see, output mode. Set this as to advanced streaming audio track. Just leave it at one. Why is my bit wait twenty five? But it's just supposed to be thirty five. Um, and uh, after that, if you guys have a video code, not video code, a uh, graphics code, like an NVIDIA, um, make sure that is hardware new. So click that. Leave it as uh, CPR, CBR. Um, and then after that, present preset, my present <laughs> preset. Make it as max quality. Profile how high performance. Well, just high. Um, and that's it. If you guys are going to just use uh, sample video bit wait. Okay, this is this is like a. Uh, this is a troublemaker for most of the people. This is based on your internet connection. Mine is 3500. And uh, I, I don't need to go up higher. <laughs> but I keep hearing this is like the more you have more bit rate, the more you have like good quality live stream. So um, I'll leave it at that. I do like my I I just got my internet like a couple months ago, I believe. Yeah, in winter time. Yeah, I got I got this. 
it, my my inter my antenna is decent not like big but it's decent so uh leave it if you guys want to check out your internet connection go to uh internetspeed.net or something just type it in google and it'll show up um this is for streaming yeah okay so audio bitrate go to 320 i don't know what that does and uh yeah that's it that's uh literally it yeah it's, it's not too bad uh my pc can handle it <laughs> to be honest don't mess with these ones max b frames a oh, bit with frames i don't really like touch those i only touch the uh the encoder the cbr i think it's like control bit rate maybe i think that's that's what it stands for but i don't know i could be wrong um bit rate my internet speed max quality profile high you can leave it at main if you want um for for the rest of the um low end pcs if you guys have a low end pc this is a good video for you because I used to be a low end PC myself with a laptop. So, uh, first off, make sure that you guys' uh, stuff is that your base and output will be 720, no, 1280 by 720. And change this to by Bill, Billy Neo. By, Billy Neo? I, I don't know. Fastest but blurry if scaling. It's gonna make the um, so it's gonna be still gonna be like kind of HD, but it's gonna be blurry. And uh, after that, change this to 30 FPS. And after that, after that, go to uh, output, go to sam simple, and uh, it depends on your internet connection. If you guys don't have a video like graphics card. Make sure that is a uh, software x64. Depends on your GPU, I think. No CPU on your um, PC. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, to be honest. Um, this thing is really, really like simple and uh, easy how to live stream. Um, after that, when you get everything set up, go to li go live. I don't know what happened. I used to have Prime. I don't know what happened. And uh, I like when Streamlabs, when you like press go live, you can actually like type in what you want. That's really cool. I really like that. But um, that is for the video. So if this helped you, make sure you guys hit the like button. If you guys have any, uh, if there is something wrong, make sure you guys comment down below and I will try to fix it. I'm not like a like a professional um like fixing pcs and shit it doesn't mean anything but um just leave it down below if you guys have any uh suggestions uh suggestions like if you get if there's something wrong with it just leave it down below and uh i will try to help you guys um so if you guys enjoy this video make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe for more and uh yeah that's it hope you guys enjoy live stream if this is your first time live streaming enjoy it <laughs>